Okay, we're gonna make sodium silicate. Um, I tried to go out and buy it today, and while there's a lot of places you can buy sodium silicate online, uh, there are not many uh, places. Uh, in fact, I, I couldn't find it anywhere. It's not at Lowe's, not at Home Depot, not at Agway, all those types of things. Here's the ingredients that you're gonna need. You're gonna need distilled water, uh, 400, uh, excuse me, at 1,000 uh, milliliters or a liter of distilled water. Uh, you're going to need 400 grams of lye, 100% pure lye. Uh, you can find that in the, in the drain opener section. Um, and you, I already have it measured out. And I already have the one liter of water measured out in a stainless steel uh, pan. You're going to want to use uh, something that can withstand the heat. It's going to get warm. And 600 grams of uh, silica. Uh, silica gel, which I happen to buy as kitty litter. And then you, uh, we're going to go outside. I'll show you the, the combining process. Alrighty, so we're outside. Uh, I'm not sure what kind of fumes this is going to kick up, so I'm not going to do it in the house. Um, I'm going to add the lye, which has been pre-measured to the um, to the distilled water. I'm going to do it slowly. It's going to heat up, create a lot of heat. I'm going to have to stir it. Um, I have two different, a couple different options here for stirring. Um, a couple different options for stirring. It's going to get warm and dissolve. So I'm going to finish up the remainder of that, uh, doing the same thing. Uh, stirring, adding a little bit at a time. And then I'm going to come uh, pause the video and come back to add the silica. Okay, that didn't take long. Um, maybe a couple of minutes. You can see all the lye is all the lye is dissolved. You can see it's steaming. Um, it's pretty hot. Uh, that's why I have it on a cutting board. I just uh, an old cutting board. I didn't just set it on my picnic table out here. So we're going to do the same thing with the lye. Add the lye. Um, and uh, or excuse me the uh, silica gel until the until that's dissolved and then we're going to add some heat so we'll just stop the video now and add the silica alrighty we've added the silica and you can see it's um, pretty warm in there and continuing to stir it up like we're supposed to and I wouldn't be surprised if it didn't start boiling all on its own in a minute and then we're going to add some heat in a little bit. Uh, I've got my gas grill over there fired up. I'm going to set it right on the, this whole pot right on the gas grill until the silica dissolves. Um, and you'll see how it, uh, how it looks at that point. Pause again. All right, so now I've got it on the gas grill. Continuing to stir it. I'm not sure. It's pretty smoky. I'm not sure how the, uh, or steamy would be a better way to put it. I'm not sure how the uh, video is coming out, but we'll see. So that's just helping uh, the process of the dis dissolving of the silica gel. And when this is done, I'm going to uh, show you what it looks like. <clears throat> All right, it's done. I've still got it on the heat. I'm going to take it off in a second, but you'll see what it looks like. And how you know when it's done everything will be dissolved um, I don't I guess with all that steam it's probably hard to see in there but everything will be dissolved um, if you take it off the heat and stop stirring it a light film will a light film will uh, grow uh, across the top of it and when you take it off your spoon uh, like so it's gonna do that and that's when you know that you're that's when you know that you're done and you can just cool it off and bottle it up and use it for what you want to use it for later on in my case uh, um, I'm going to be uh, building a little bit of a forge with it you'll be able to watch that in a later video thanks bye